This is Jordan Tower with JT News. Make sure you smash that like button, smash that subscribe button. I'm taking it easy today. I'm sure you guys are too. And do not forget, do not forget, well, I got you here. My Instagram, my original one, Jordan Tower JTF is gone. They, they, It's obliterated, gone. They got rid of it, okay? I don't know why. I don't really post there that much. But it was a wake-up call that I should be posting more on Instagram. So go follow my new Instagram below, Jordan Tower News. I'll be posting a lot more on there, probably daily on different news topics, and it will coincide with what we do here. And I'm trying to, I need to, you guys to all go over there so we can get a network going. Uh, and you're following me here and there, okay? So I appreciate you guys. And let's get right into the news. Somebody pissed a big soldier. He's mad, okay? So he's going off on one of his other rants saying he's been done everything. But he's specifically talking to somebody. He's saying, you dumb guy, you don't realize who I, who I am. I've had record deals. I've gone viral. I've done this. He's done everything, okay? He's big soldier, okay? Now, listen to his rant here. Uh, he might be back on that stuff, my G, because I'm going to be honest with you. He's been pretty calm ever since he came home and he was back on just, you know, you know, he was just back doing him, being a normal guy, man. You know, like uh, he wasn't on any substances or anything. He was being normal. And all of a sudden, he has a rant. Now, we all know, we, we don't need to know his accolades over and over again. We know where he is. He's, he's, he's that guy, man. And yeah, he keeps saying people want to be him. You influenced a generation. Come on, my G. You influenced everybody. Don't, don't worry, you know. Come on, man. Here's the little rant he did right here. Sign a record deal. I've been did it. Any group I've been did it. Doing song with these rap. I've been did it. Come on, y'all. Late. Y'all catching up. Going viral on the internet. I've been did it. Come on. I don't need no song with none of you. I've been did this. Y'all late. Y'all late. This doing I did that when I was 17. You think you doing something? Boy, you ain't doing shit. what? You talking about you 10 years late? Catch up. You talking about I've been doing this Wayne man. Boy, you can never be me. Don't never get it confused. You talking about you got about 10 more years of work to put in. I'm the first rapper on YouTube, boy. You talking about they acting like they doing something? They got Ben did this. Shit. Ben did something with all these fake ass rap niggas. Ben met all of them. Cut it out. You late. You late to the show. Come on. Just copying my moves. Following me, you don't want to be me, but you not me, boy. Talking about big Draco to the biggest Draco. Stop playing with me, Wayne. You will never be on my level. Talking and it still ain't been done to this day. First my song got dropped went platinum. What you talking about? Wayne, 16 years old, nigga. First song, nigga. Crank that, nigga. Platinum, nigga. Stop playing with me, nigga. And I produced the song, and I wrote the song, nigga. That still ain't been dead to this day, nigga. Ain't nobody written no fucking song to produce the song at 16 and it went number one for seven weeks on the Billboard charts. Man, y'all, boy. You talking about, you will never be on my level. Wayne, but you's a can't rap. Wanna be me? Sneak dissing. Drop a location, Wayne. What you talking about? Y'all nigga wanna be me and I get it, but you will never be me, nigga. What you talking about, nigga? Get that through your head, boy. It's only one soldier, nigga. 
Then we got Daz. He reacts to Eminem dissing Snoop Dogg. Now, let's be honest. Snoop Dogg's been kind of... Th- th- I'm going to tell you something about Snoop Dogg and Eminem. I think they're both jealousy of each other over one thing. And this is him right here. They're both jealous of Dr. Dre and the d- attention Dr. Dre gives to them separately, okay? Uh, Snoop s- even said himself, hey, he wouldn't be the number one rapper if uh, yeah, Dr. Dre made that. He could have picked any white boy. Then he also said, I don't listen to that junk. He said that, okay? He said that in an old interview. In the most recent one, he said he just wasn't his top 10. There's an older interview where Snoop Dogg is talking about that he's trash almost. Well, not trash, but he says he's, you know, he just doesn't listen to that. It's not for him, which is fine. But he goes a little hard with it. Like, you know, Drake could have made anyone like this and this and that. And it was like, okay, stop. Uh, Daz... What does he say? He says he doesn't go too far into detail with it because, you know, he just he just gives his commentary. And he says at Snoop Dogg, wow, what's next from the two icons of rap? Wow. At Eminem diss Snoop Dogg, wow, what's next from the two icons of rap? Uh, Machine Gun Kelly, you know, he just says the subs on this. And he says all because he said he isn't the top 10. Someone else says Snoop won't respond. He fell off a long time ago. Eh, it's, you can't say that Snoop fell off. Snoop's been doing this for 30 years, my G. That's like, that's that's ridiculous to say that, okay? We all wish he was able to freestyle. Like, he, oh, stop it. You know, these are some of these people are just really dumb to react to that. Snoop Dogg is a legend, okay? And they should realize that Snoop Dogg is hip-hop. He is the face of hip hop. Wherever it, what, he is, the most recognizable person in hip hop. Madonna's lost her mind. She looks like she lost her mind, and she has lost her mind. She thinks that starting tomorrow, this is what's funny about this. I'll tell you what's funny about this: that Instagram's updating their policies, and that it's becoming a, a dictatorship. She says they can listen. They can spy on your family cyber surveillance she says they can get the most intimate secrets and monitor compliance with government mandates through your devices including your television wake up madonna this has been happening for the past eight years wake up it's probably been actually more than that 12 years uh snowden told you about it she's just she's just noticing this now She's out to lunch. Wake up! Like, uh, what can you say? Wake up! <laughs> this is happening. Why do you think you have devices in your home listening for your next command? Come on. This is happening. It's over, Madonna. Uh, we live. We already live uh, in this <laughs> society that you're talking about. Government and industry to punish your disobedience. Yes, we already live in that. You don't choose who the, the uh, government officials are or anything. It, it sounds good, but you really don't, okay? Uh, mostly everything is corrupted, okay? I, even my HOA is corrupted, okay? <laughs> even my own homeowners association, I realized that after looking at the budget and a bunch of other stuff, and I called it out, and they just, shh, the lawyer just tried to silence me. I said, okay, it's time, time to move on from this experience <laughs> anyways guys this is jordan tower with jt news i appreciate you guys so much smash that like button okay and don't forget my instagram my original instagram jordan tower jtf is gone they got rid of it for no reason i don't know why but you know what i'm not gonna cry about it i started another one jordan tower news go follow that one the link is below let's get it going you know it's a wake-up call i should be posting more on my instagram anyways so we're going to get that going, okay? So please support. Go over there. Follow it. Let's get it up to a couple thousand so we can at least feel like, you know, we're worthy out here. All right. I'll check you guys later. Peace.